Hello guys, welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial, in this After Effects tutorial, we are going to create this. Here you can see, I have already imported the particles and smoke background media files, required for this project. You can download them for free from below link in the description, the complete After Effects template is also available for free. On my web store, link is provided in the description. Now let's create our trailer title. Create a new composition, I will name it as slide 1. Here you can set the time duration for this composition. I will set it to 4 seconds. Perfect. Now let's add the text. Here I am using Montserrat font family, you can use any font style of your choice, I will change font style to bold. Increase the font size. Now align the text to center. Make sure paragraph alignment is set to center text. Perfect. Now for this text layer. In animate, select tracking. At end of the timeline, create keyframe for tracking amount. At start, change tracking value to near about 15. You can see the preview. Perfect. Now let's create a new adjustment layer. For adjustment layer, in effects and preset, search for gradient ramp. Add it to the adjustment layer. Now in effects and preset, search for color roam. Add it to the adjustment layer. In output cycle, use preset golden one. Now in effects and preset, search for bevel alpha, add it to the adjustment layer. Perfect. Now again create a new adjustment layer. In effects and preset, search for tint. Add it to the adjustment layer. Now in effects and preset, search for curves. Add it to the adjustment layer. Here you need to adjust the curves, exactly as I am going to show. Here you can see the effect of curves. Perfect. For this adjustment layer, in effects and preset, search for CC toner. Add it to the adjustment layer. Set the mid-tone color. Here you can set any color for your text layer. Here I will make the text look golden. Perfect. Select all layers. Pre-compose them. Name it as text1. Perfect. Now from project panel, let's add the background smoke media file to the timeline. For media file, in effects and preset, search for curves. Add it to the background smoke layer. Now slightly adjust the curves as shown. Now create a new adjustment layer. 
in effects and preset, search for fast box blur, add it to the adjustment layer. Set blur radius to 0.5. Change iteration to 1. Now in effects and preset, search for unsharp mask, add it to the adjustment layer. For unsharp mask, set amount to 500. Change radius to 0.5. From project panel, let's add the particles media file to the timeline. For the text composition, press S to bring up the scale. At end of the timeline, create keyframe for scale. Now at start, change scale value to 120%. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Here our slide 1 is created. Now let's see how to create multiple slides. Here first I will create duplicates of this text 1 composition. Press Ctrl plus D to create duplicates. Here I will create 5 duplicates of this text compositions. Now open the created text compositions. Here we will replace all the text for all compositions. Perfect. Now let's create 5 duplicates of this slide composition. Press Ctrl plus D to create duplicates. Open all the slide compositions. Now for slide 2 composition, we need to replace this text 1 composition, with this text 2 composition. Now while pressing Alt key, drag and drop the text 2 composition on text 1 composition. This will replace text 1 composition with text 2 composition. Similarly we will do the same for all other slides compositions. For slide 3 composition, replace text 1 composition with text 3 composition. For slide 4 composition, replace text 1 composition with text 4 composition. Here all the 6 slides compositions are ready, now let's see how to bring them in single composition. Create a new composition, I will name this composition as trailer title. Here I will set time duration to 12 seconds. You can increase or decrease the time duration depending on the number of slide compositions you have created. Now add all the slide compositions to the timeline. Place them in sequence as shown. Here I will place them at distance of just 2 seconds, you can increase or decrease the gap between. You can also add footage in between these slides. Now create a new solid layer. Name it as frame. Make sure fill color is set to black. Now double click on this rectangle tool to create mask for solid layer. For mask 1, change mask path, change unit to percent of source. Change top to 10%, change bottom to 90%. Select inverted. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Here our trailer title is created. Similarly if you want to extend your trailer, you can create multiple slides and add it to the composition and create your trailer. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial.